Joe will actually run from these people. Ah! <laughs> that was unexpected. Hey everyone, Migs here, and welcome back to Alan Wake 2, where this might be, possibly, probably, maybe not, I really don't know if this is the finale of this game. And I say that because at the end of the last episode, the game pretty much gave us that point of no return message where it says, you know, do what you want to do right now because there's no turning back, which usually means that this is at the end. Um, but at the same time, there's still, I think, a lot that can be done you know and uh in regards to alan's side of the story where he's at the dark place i i don't know because the game basically brought us back to saga's side of the story uh so i don't know if we could actually continue on with alan's i don't know what i'm doing right now is basically just following saga's side of the story right now and see where it takes us so if this is the end it's been a blast you guys thank you all so much for watching and let's not waste another minute and let's get to it. All right, so here we are. And um, something I should mention is that I went ahead and picked up the shotgun that was here on, you know, when I was not recording, obviously. I just wanted to get that out of the way as well as sort out all of my inventory, all of my uh, loadout here. And I think we're ready, guys. So let's go ahead and let's go. Ready to go? Yep, this is the beginning of the end. To travel to Cauldron Lake, you need to save your game first. Exploring and traveling to other areas will be limited if you choose to continue. Okay, let's go. I'm ready to head to Cauldron Lake now. Let's get the plan started. Okay, here we go. We'll be there for you. What do you need from us? I'll head to Cauldron Lake with the clicker. Scratch, we'll try to get you, Anderson. You'll need backup. I can tell there's no talking you out of coming, Casey. Uh, you're in no form yes, to help does. me. Is there a way to get that light array to the lake? Oh, I've got you covered, so good news there. And we'll bring our mobile containment unit. It's specially built for entities like Scratch. And this work of art, Anderson. Exciting. What's the plan for that? I'll make some calls on the way. Just meet me at Cauldron Lake. All right. Guess we're off. Can't talk to these guys anymore. Uh, perform the ritual at Cauldron Lake. All right, so we got to drive, make our drive over there. Uh, with what car? Do I just take the police car? Tor, I need the old gods of Asgard. I need a very special song. Oh my God. You saw this coming, huh? Of course. I need a song about Alan Wake. About bringing him out of the dark place. They're just gonna write a song right now. I hope they've still got it. I don't know why the audio kind of cut off there. I was just walking towards the car. What are they, these people taking selfies out inside in the rain? At night. <laughs> it's so bizarre. But yeah, let's go ahead. I think my car is parked here still. Yes, it is. All right. This is it, y'all. To Cauldron Lake. Pick up, pick up. David, please pick up. The story's... David. David. It's me. Where have you- Stop. For once, you need to listen. You left me. You took my daughter away from me. Then you let her- Don't believe it, Saga. She's dead because of you. How sad would that be, though, if it was actually true? I want to hear your voice again. And all of this is just, like, in Saga's head. She's Stop going crazy. Why are you letting it get to you, Saga? 
Just fix the story. It's worse. It's spreading. I'm running out of time. Um, I don't know if I want to have the... Actually, no. Okay, I have the pistol on. Uh, we should actually heal up real quick. I was trying to heal over at the station, but it wouldn't allow me. What kind of BS is that? Let's, yeah, let's go. Let's go with this. Alright. Let's be prepared. Don't know what's here. There's gonna be many enemies now, aren't there? I mean, should I even have the pistol out? Or should I bring up the big boys now? Don't know. Oh, I've stopped. I need to go back. Oh. Got a case to solve. Well, <laughs> I thought that was the uh, the way. Okay, Cauldron Lake. Here, but there's no entry. I'm pretty sure that helicopter is uh, the FBC, yeah? It's gotta be. We're incoming with the oh, light. God, scared Anderson, me. Where do you want them? Set them up on the shore. We need to be ready if Scratch shows up. We'll be ready. I wonder if I should just run for it, yeah? Although they might catch up to me, like, with the quickness. I don't know. Where's my route? I think it's straight ahead. Yeah. Okay, I'm running for it. Come and catch me! I'm trying to save up on all the ammo, guys. I'm not even trying to fight. That must be torn Odin. Maybe I should check in. Oh. Kiddo! We're almost at the gig! And Odin has run over four minions of darkness! <laughs> well done. The boss is our hammer! I'm driving with one hand! <laughs> oh my god! Is the song ready? They couldn't wait for maybe giving me a, a ride? To the pedal. Is this the way I'm supposed to be going? Very rock and roll way to drive. I don't think this is where I'm supposed to be. No, no, this is good. Right? Can I, can I get through? I cannot? Oh, there it is. What I'm kind of paranoid about right here is um, running to any wolves, because those are probably one of the scariest enemies that I've experienced in this game. My god. They are just running amok. Amok amok. You little... Oh, hell.
Oh. <laughs> she tripped. What an idiot. I hate these fast dudes, man. Whoa. Saga. Yeah, good job, Saga. Wait a wait, wait, wait to use all of your ammo. Rock, rock, tree, are you bright enough? Rock, rock, tree, are you bright enough? Huh? Okay. Um, rock. Rock, rock, tree. Rock, rock, tree. Rock, rock, tree. So, oh. Eight. What? Okay, we got some maths. We got some maths. Pardon me. <laughs> uh, where's the other rock at, though? I uh, up oh, there it is. What? Okay, so seven minus two. Okay, f five. <laughs> five, three, eight? Five, three, eight? Is that it? Oh, five. Five, six, eight. Five, six, eight. No? Okay, so it's a six, five, eight. There it is. That was one of the easier ones. Okay, can't pick that up. Can't pick that up. Are you one of us or one of them? I'm the good person, the good guy. Don't worry about it. Okay. The lights in the containment cell are good to go, Anderson. Great. The Torin Ode in there yet? <laughs> the two golden oldies? Oh, well, they're here. And they bought moonshine. I love them already. <laughs> They're a lot. You wanted to know what art we would use? Well, that's them. I'll be there soon. More of those rhymes. More of those rhymes, guys. Huh. Let there be light. Is this a save point? I believe so. It is. All right. Um, what is this? Guess. Blah blah blah. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> All right. Uh, nothing for us to collect in here. There's a shoe box there, though, just in case y'all want to do some last-minute changes. But um, I think I think we are done here. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to mess with that nursery rhyme and spend like half an hour there. <laughs> we shall proceed. Oh. Can I just bulk cut that at? No. <laughs> Wish it was that easy. Sheriff's keys. You would think bulk cutters would do it, right? But I guess not. Okay. Onward. Oh, I hear I hear them. One, two. How you feeling tonight? Holy Yo, I'm running out of ammo, man. What is even happening? Oh god. Gravity. The black hole friend. 
I wish to run away from you. <laughs> ah, it's still following me. God, what a creepy concept having a puddle just follow you like that. Summoning. I'm here. I'm here. Let's get ready. Anderson, we've set up control center. It's a shoe box there. Anderson, I can drop more gear down for you to run in the wall. Oh, yeah. Get the taken when they come. Light them up for you. Bad news is we were in a hurry. The power supply is spotty. Your partner here will try to keep it running. But I, I'm not a damn mechanic. I wish your tech guy was here, Karen. Okay, so this is a, uh, this is an arena. This is, uh, <laughs> we're going to experience a boss here, I think. This is, this is like the first game where Alan was on the farm, the Anderson farm, and then there was a sh just a shit ton of Taken that were just coming at you. My guess is that we're about to experience that right now, but first let's go ahead and load up with everything that we can. Right, right, right. Give me one second. You signal me when the song is done, and I'll use the clicker to bring Wake back. Hit it! Oh, I'm scared. Hello, Cauldron Wake! Great to see so many federal agents here tonight. Prepare to experience a soul searing mind fry act of black magic and sorcery! This song goes out to our favorite torture Oh, they're up there. Let these sweet tunes guide you out of the darkness. It's called Dark Ocean Summer Name. Sick. All right. Hey, you're making me look bad in front of Saga, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's try that again. <laughs> I want to try these flares here. Survive the summoning ritual. Yep. A whole lot of paranormal crimes happening right now. Is that so? Fucking awesome. I want a T-shirt. Where are they? Where? Take an incoming, Anderson. Where? Oh my gosh. More taken on the way. Oh, oh my God. I'll blast him with the light. I blocked. Oh my god, there's so many.
Oh god, this is so tense. Oh, I need to heal. I need to heal. I got him for you, Anderson. Yes, please. Did this thing follow me? Bring around the roses. Whoa. So freaking intense. I'll get him into the light. God. Ow. There's so many of them. That was a lot of fun. Oh my god. Look at all this ammo. Uh, are, we, are, are we about to face more? Oh shit. Just a clicker. Was, that was so intense. I don't think I was what even happened? speaking or talking. I may have Why just been mumbling work? words. I did everything right. Art to bring him back? Clicker to make it real? So where the fuck is he? He's still in the dark place. Oh, now we're heading back to his story. Okay. Right, right, here we are. It was back. Now we're allowed to go back inside Parliament Tower. I wonder how much more of his story we have left, considering that Sagas is almost done. I've been trying to even it out. So maybe we're close to the end for Alan. I'd been here many times before. Oh, uh, it's all decrepit. What happened to this, this place? different. Like my last chance. It wasn't already too late. That's gonna prepare for that elevator jump scare, guys. It's coming right here. Oh, no cameras. Gone. You, 
was I Bastard. <laughs> Get to the writer's room. Scratch was in there, writing his horror story. There was still time to stop him. I needed uh -huh. to get inside. Is this the way? Is this the way, Alan? He's going to be in that room. Oh. It won't end. Like He's going to grab her from behind. Wake up from. I thought I could contain Helen in my photos, but I can't. The monster just keeps coming. Like waves hitting the shore. I'm... I'm so tired. He's here all the time now. There's so much rage inside of him, I can't stand it anymore. Most of you won't understand. People call me an artist, but I don't care about any of that. I just wanted to show the world what I see. I can't keep going like I have been. It's time for a perspective shift. To go from photographer to subject. From artist to art. Alice Wake took her own life shortly after completing her work on The Dark Place. She will be missed, but will live on through her art. Whoa. What follows are her final photographs. That's Alice, yes? Or is that Alan? No, that's Alice. Oh, she jumped. She jumped. Was she? That's Cauldron Lake. So she jumped into Cauldron Lake. This is true. Her. This is the ritual to lead you on. 
Your friends will meet him when you're gone. Well, there you go. That's the end of initiation. And we still have plenty more time, guys. Oh, a brand new song, a brand new beat. But we've got much to do still, so let's continue on. <laughs> What was that? Do you see that one frame right there? We did bring Wake back from the dark place with a song and the clicker. But he didn't end up here now. He landed on the shore after I faced Nightingale in the overlap. Wake here. He appeared because of this. The summoning. That was Wake. Scratch wasn't pretending to be Wake. They're the same person. Okay, so I was He's right. Here. Scratch! Watch out, Anderson! Estevez, Scratch is Wake with the dark presence inside him. Yeah. He wants the clicker. Change of plan. I'll lure him to the cell. When we're inside, lock it. And blast it with all you got. Oh my god. What am I supposed to be doing? God. Yo, I'm about to die. I'm about to die here. Oh, Oh my god. Oh god. Come on, come on, come on. Shit, he's free. He's 
coming. Need to rotate the lights. Get him where it hurts, kiddo. Take her down, devil. Ugh. Ammo, I need ammo. Oh god. Why am I in here? I'm an idiot. Up any of that ammo. Dude, chill out, man. Scratch. All right. Uh, how? Oh, can we just walk in there? <laughs> that took a lot longer than it should have. See, I had a feeling it, it was Scratch controlling his body. Oh! Casey? Casey. It took over Casey's body. Oh no! Oh, he got the clicker. This is wild. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, folks, but it's official. Tear Fest is canceled. Oh, snap. Today, bright Falls feels a little less bright. He hit it. What does that mean for Scratch if he hits the clicker? Who, who caught that? Who, who caught that there? Wow. <laughs> this sounds like uh, the old gods. Oh my gosh. We do have a little bit of more time here, but I don't know how much more time. So I don't know if we should end things here or, or what. I'm a little, I'm a little torn. I want to continue on, but also it's like, I don't know how much more there is. <laughs> What is that? It all play out like a horror movie I've been forced to watch. The dark presence held all the cards now. They're heading towards the dark place. Oh my god, it's a portal. I mean, we we already knew it was a portal, but still. Oh my goodness. 
You know what? Let's just continue on a little bit more. Just a little bit. Just to see where this is going to take us now. It, it appears that we're going to have to go back inside the dark place. Welcome back, Wake. Yeah, I'm back. You are awake now, right? With the shadow out of you? Some good news, at least. Bad news is, I haven't seen a situation this fucked since the AWE in Eagle River. Eagle River. The shadow's now in Alex, and Anderson is gone. We need to figure out how to salvage this. What can I do to help? I'll do anything it takes to fix this, Agent Estevez. I'm the reason this is all happening. It's never that simple. But I should have put you I in see a some box goodies here for me. <laughs> you off to a containment facility the second I laid eyes on you. The only question now is are you able to fix this? Sure. I can try. Not the most encouraging answer, but we'll make it work. <laughs> um, what's the situation? What's the situation? I've never seen an entity break a bureau containment unit like that. And now the dark presence is occupying Agent Casey. When it attacked him in the woods, it must have been preparing for this. And now he is the clicker. About Saga. Scratch. The dark presence inside Casey. It threw Saga into the lake. If she ends up in the dark place, she could be there forever. It took me 13 years to get out. Zane never did. Tor and Odin went in after her, right? Maybe they'll get her out. With the power of rock and roll. <laughs> I saw them when I was trapped there. They performed in my musical. I'm immediately less optimistic about this. <laughs> uh, I think I can fix this. What was that? Scratch will go to Bright Falls and use the clicker to bring about the horrific ending he wrote for Return. But I can still fix this. How? Scratch must have the manuscript. If I can read the ending, I can rewrite it. I need to go after him. <sighs> well, you won't get very far without these. Hell yeah. This plan Give me the goodies. Is a real Hail Mary wake. I wish I could help, but this is all on you. I got you every kind of weapon we have available. Oh, hell yeah. Wait, is, it, is that it? <laughs> no, I got more than just this? I needed a car. The FBI vehicle would be at the parking lot. Well, there we go. We got the gear. What else you got? Stand up, please. I'm going to get the stuff. Um, would you be sitting on some more things that I can collect? No? <laughs> Alright, I guess um, we head to the parking lot. Oh, great. <laughs> we have to make our way back up there, which means we're most likely going to encounter some more... Um, some more Taken. Right? Or I don't know, maybe the fact that we hit the clicker and had this whole big extravagant performance, then maybe we won't have to deal with that. Also, how do I get to the parking lot? <laughs> I'll tell you what. Um, once we figure out where to go, oh, it's through here. Um, I was awake again, clear-headed for the first time in what felt like a lifetime. I was back exactly where I left, a dark forest outside Bright Falls, a gun in one hand. A flashlight in the other, haunted by my own writing. Alice taken from me. Okay. I knew what I had to do. Stop the horror story from coming true. Stop the dark presence. Okay, so this is what I'm gathering here. Is that when he had first came back um, during that first chapter, his body was Alan Wiggs, but it was Scratch that was taking over his mind the whole entire time. And only now has he actually woken up and he is now truly 100% Alan Wake. That's what I'm... Doing. You guys shouldn't be here. You guys shouldn't be here. Follow me. You, I, you think I, I, I can't tell when you're about to attack me? I can predict everything, sirs. Oh, I don't have a map. 
Oh, that's dirty. Okay. Well. My guess is that we just follow the lights. And I'm gonna run over here. Goodbye! Oh, shoot. That's a dead end. This is where we encountered the, the wolf. Hey, hold this. <laughs> Someone else. I'm gonna go this way. Or maybe not. Holy! I'm in the light, idiot. <laughs> okay, hold on. I need to quick slot this, obviously. <laughs> I haven't had to quick slot it. There we go. And we are officially out of uh, pistol ammo. And it looks like the game is not going to give us any more. It's not generous. It hates us. But that's fine. We can make this happen still. Oh. Here we go. What the hell was that? Is locked? It's not. Zippity doo da. I know the game just saved, but I want to actually get to an actual save point before we end things here. I feel like we're about to hit some enemies real soon. It's a red light up ahead. I remember that. <laughs> they all just running place, after me. <laughs> the dark presence went into me. When I was pulled back here, crossing over weakened it, made it, it dormant. How's I it? I couldn't remember what had happened, but I could feel it getting stronger, waking up. I thought it was haunting me, closing in. It was inside me the whole time, and then it took over. Oh, here. Turn me into scratch. Activity detected. Okay, he's probably just alerting because of the fact of what's happening right now. Nothing different, nothing new. It's just uh, letting us know, yeah, yeah, what you're experiencing is some really messed up stuff. Okay, I think we're getting real close. We should be getting real close. Yeah, yeah, see, there's that gate. And I don't think we'll be running into more enemies, but I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure this is just a straight shot. Unless the game throws us a surprise. Which, uh, I wouldn't really appreciate much. You know, like, I would really just like to get out of this scary ass uh place I mean at least okay I, I, it's a good thing I suppose that the game is blocking off certain paths because um it helps us with um Knowing where exactly to go, you know, it's leading I us to get to Bright Falls to where we need to go. See this through to the end. Yeah, let's go. I 
I brought Saga Anderson into this story to help me escape. She succeeded. It cost her everything. I'd used Alex Casey in my it's writing for years. It's not synced. The real Casey had been drawn here because of that. Now he was a victim too. Saga, Casey, Alice, all this horror originates from me. It's my fault. Scratch had to be stopped. I've driven down this road before. Been driving on it forever. Pretty cool that he's like officially back, right? He's actually Scratch driving around. Place here. This would take me back inside. In 2010, I had dived in. A leap of faith for Alice. With no idea that the cost would be a nightmare worse than death. It had taken me 13 years to get out. Now Alice was dead. Because of me. And I was going to make that leap again, this time knowing the cost all too well. Oh, awesome callback, dude. Awesome call back to the first game there. The way to look at it, I had brought the dark place here with me. I never had gotten out. Even the music. After this, I finally could. It was a fool's hope. I had no choice. I had to do it. This music is from the first game. It's like the theme song of the first game. That. This is so epic, dude. Fuck it. <laughs> Going in. What's what's going on now? We're at Deerfest. We're celebrating the. Uh, <laughs> we're celebrating my uh, my book release. This is. Not what I expected. Oh, this is weird. This motherfucker is a home run. Jesus. Alan Wake knows his fans and never lets them down. Tor? Odin? There's no one there. This is wild. This is like stepping into our actual world. Oh, the float. Uh. Oh. There we go. I could see the round windows <laughs> of the writer's room in the photo. Space. That's where I had to go. To rewrite oh. the ending of Return. Sick, sick story. Oh, shit. Yo, we're actually running from these people. Ah! <laughs> that was unexpected. It I now. had to get to the writer's room to stop this horror story. Awesome. Well, that was easy for him to retrieve the book. This was an obsessive, egocentric nightmare. All revolving around a vain monster of a writer. And his final divine work of art. The novel return come true. It wouldn't stop here. It would keep spreading. Oh, that's the house for the writer's room. Whose house is this, though? Is it just a random house?
Oh, I think this is a save point here. Oh, never mind. I thought there was something here that I could... Oh, it's just a reflection. What is this? This looks like the retirement home, but I don't think it is. Or maybe it is. I have to get inside. It is. I, I remember now. I remember this location. Okay. Well, let's head inside. No? We're not heading inside? But they're here. This door's open. Oh. Alice. Alice. What was that? Alice was dead. Was this a trap? Or was Scratch torturing me? A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Oh, why did I do that? Also, where where's all my stuff? I don't have anything. I, I, I have no choice but to just run. No, that's not the way. Yes, my sweet. My love. Oh, that is a dead end. See, I had a feeling, I had a feeling that we, uh, <laughs> that little light room was just a trick. But he's very pushy. Rose, right? From the diner. How are you here? <laughs> I'm here to save you, silly. I got your instructions. I found every hidden message you left for me. In the radio, in the wind, in the forums on my Alan Wake fan site. What? No, Rose, I haven't been leaving you any messages. I get it. Yes, Alan, only a crazy person <laughs> would think you've been leaving them secret messages. <laughs> Wink. But now you need to get your butt upstairs, Alan. This shit won't write itself, no matter what William Shakespeare said. Right. Thank you, Rose. I'll do what I can. Are we not going to get a save? Is, is this... <laughs> Am I just going to continue on here? I don't have a map. I did I upstairs. The writer's room must be in the attic. That's where the windows were. I didn't want to have an I didn't want to have a super extra long episode. Oh, hi Auntie. Come to Keter, Tom. I have put everything ready for the visitors. I'll come to wash the floor of your room next. Huh? All you need is water and pileta. Water is the oldest pulp. Water finds its way. What water brings, it takes away. It can be clean or dirty. It can keep life or drown it. Akti. I didn't expect to see you here, but it makes sense. Can you help me find my way? One last time. Mm. Oh, there's a devil in the fist trap. Don't be spooked by it so that shit won't start beating your underpants. <laughs> what is that even supposed to mean? Okay. I'll get the door open for you, Tom. I'm pretty sure he's calling me Tom because of uh, Thomas Zane. I just want to make sure if there's any save point. Oh, wait. No. Now comes the end of the rhyme. Here Thank we go. You. 
Interesting. So the writer's room was always I was here. I needed to write the ending. I only had one chance to get this right. It was always in the uh, nursing home. Return's ending was an eternal deer fest that would keep spreading. Given time, Scratch would plunge the world into his nightmare. I had to stop that from happening. I had to write one more chapter for Return. How? I needed an ending that took everything already in return and extended it into a conclusion that would save us. Only the perfect ending would work. A perfect ending that would save us all. I was the only one who could write it. Everything depended on this. On me. Any second now, Scratch would burst through that door to stop me. Every plot thread dangled in my brain. It suddenly felt impossible. Something stirred in the room. Coming to me. There's an echo in here. Idea. The ending has to fit the genre if it's going to work. In a horror story, there's only victims and monsters. If there is Aero, they will ultimately pay a heavy price. I won't let the horror story take Logan and Casey. Oh, so one of them is going to die, or both of them. They need to survive. Non-negotiable. Not just them. We need to try to save everyone. The ending will have to be dark no matter what. The more people we save, the greater the cost. And the hero must pay the price. The scales always need to Here we go. Okay, we got a new uh, thing for the plot board. Pay the price. Something felt different. I'd never seen myself in a vision before, but it fit. Saga and I were both at the center of this story. She was now my co-author. This was the beginning of the end. We were characters in a horror story, charging blindly towards the finale. We still didn't have everything we needed. This would not work without the clicker. There we go! Perfect timing to, to end things. No one left alone. Alright. Well, as this plays on, let's go ahead and uh, close this video out, so to speak. Um, very intense episode, I gotta say. And just so much happening. You know, what with um, Saga defeating Scratch, at least, you know, the... Uh, 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 the Alan possessed Scratch or the Scratch possessed Alan. You know what I'm talking about here, guys. And also that very explosive musical number by the Anderson Brothers. We got to see an encore yet again from them, which was a very pleasant surprise. And it just felt like there were so many callbacks here, not only with the first game, but with the this game, you know, from all that's happened since the beginning. You know, and just seeing everything come together for this finale. Also, I cannot stress enough, I definitely knew, I had, I knew that it was actually Scratch possessing Al's, Alan's body uh, rather than, you know, a physical doppelganger actually just pretending to be Al, Alan the whole entire time. I mean, sure, he was doing that um, since he had first returned, but, um, you know, Alan did prevail, you know, he did end up uh, coming back for his return, um, which is uh, very symbolic considering that this is the hero's journey and him returning is leading towards the finale, the epic finale of this incredible story. So stay tuned for that. In the meantime, I want to thank you all for watching. Let me know what your your thoughts about this whole entire episode, as well as what you thought about everything that led up to this point of the story. Of course, keep it spoiler free. We are nearing the end. The next episode of this Let's Play series will absolutely 100% be the finale of this game, of this Let's Play series, so stay tuned for that. 
But also, if you enjoyed today's video, please do not, for do not forget to leave a like. And if you're new to the channel, please do consider subscribing as well as ring the bell so that you're notified for the next video, which will most likely be within a day or two. I think I just want to just pump this out this weekend and then that'll be that. So stay tuned for that. And that's going to be it. So thank you so much again for watching. My name is MixXL and I will see you in the next video.